Today we are finally back on the toy hauler build, continuing on with some of the things I need to get it road registered so I can take it in and get the canopy skinned. I got this trailer chain adapters from a mob called Couple Mate. Three and a half ton kit, 235 bucks. Comes with one for either side, hammer locks, and some fairly hefty size safety chain. They go up under either side of the chassis, bolt through. I'm not sure if you need all six bolts. I'm gonna start with four and see how I go, whether it passes roadworthy or not. Use an M12 high tensile. See, the plan is clamp these up in place, mark and drill the holes, bolt them on. To try and get the holes pretty close to where they need to be, I just turned down this bit of uh, book of rod down to the size of the hole and tried to make a bit of a transfer point on there, like a, like a center punch. So I'm gonna try that, try and drill the holes, see how it goes. I've got the four holes drilled on this side, but I can't get on the inside there with a the drill to drill from that side. And I want to get them as square as possible. So I machined down this bit of booker rod a little bit further, still got that little bit of a point on the end. Made that as close as I can to 12 mil. I've already done this one. We'll do the next one at the top. It's a little bit dodgy, but it seems to work. that way, one square sideways, balance them, like that. And center punch. I had welded this sealed, so I might just put a little bit of silicon around the bolts. Stop any crap getting inside here. Uh, flat washers, spring washers and nylock nuts. Righto, let's repeat that on the other side, and then we're done. Never fitted a hammer before. Yes! It's fun. 
put a little arrow on them that tells you which direction the pin goes. Just need some bow shackles for the other end. And we're good. That's it for another week guys, safety chain's done. Tune in next week, we're gonna pull the wheels out from underneath the axles, fully weld it all up, paint it, cap the ends of that box section that goes underneath so it doesn't get rust inside of it, and throw that back underneath and then bolt it in for the last time. And then we just gotta wire it up and go get it registered. So if you like this sort of stuff, subscribe. If you have any questions, Hit me up in the comments. Other than that, it's time to crack a beer. See you next week.